Hello, my name is Jacqueline and I am the CEO and general manager of a company called Edible 915. Today I'm coming to you with a business invitation. We are looking to gain startup capital as well as glean some of your expertise in some business coaching. We have a very passionate, well-educated, and locally connected team that has been able to build a wonderful startup company that is both well received and a whole lot of fun that we love a lot. We're looking to take it to that next level and that's where you come in. We're looking for $100,000 of startup capital as well as to collaborate with you on a shadow program for the first year. Edible 915 is a local meal kit delivery system. The way it works is we partner with local farmers and growers to source most of our main ingredients. We offer a 12 to 15 meal schedule each week for all of our customers. Everything is processed in a temp kitchen that we do ourselves, we deliver to our customers. All information is both uh, given online from us and obtained back from the customer to us through our online portal. So information such as dietary needs, allergies, preferences, schedules, payment information, all that is managed online. One of the perks is that we also reach back to the community each week by partnering with a local restaurant or a chef for one of those weekly recipes that people can not only select and have brought to their home that week, but then there's also a kickback to that restaurant should they want to use a coupon or something like that to then go later and, and enjoy them again. Who is buying it and why? In 2016, meal kits were a $1.6 billion industry. Uh, by 2021, they're projected to be well into the multi-billion dollar range. Uh, on the um, in the money section of time.com while doing some market research I found that the most prominent demographic that is responding to meal kit delivery systems are called millennial urbanites so basically uh, somewhat young people that live somewhat close to a city um, how this translates to El Paso and the way that edible 915 comes in El Paso has a massive college community. There are many, both universities and junior colleges, and then trade programs. There are a lot of people in school that are really responding to this. Also, uh, El Paso has a great deal of families that are working under a budget. This service provides a huge advantage to them in regards to being able to really map their money. Also, time new experiences, DIY. What that means is is that uh, all of us are strapped for time and looking to get time back somehow. Really, by the amount of steps that we cut out by meal planning, shopping, prepping food, bringing it to your house, all of that is essentially giving time back to the customer. And that is so valuable to so many people. New experiences include things like learning how to cook. A lot of people don't know how to cook, uh, at least these days, and especially people that would fit into that college demographic. So learning how to cook. Learning more about perhaps El Paso uh, regional foods and, and what to do with those things. Or perhaps just having a fun night uh, with loved ones cooking a, a new recipe for, for them. And uh, the DIY era, uh, more and more so now, we are seeing a lot of people really enjoying just doing it yourself. We are confident. Why are we confident? In 2018, um, we know through market research that people want freshness. People want to be able to bring balanced, healthy meals home for their families. People have responded in a way that shows they're willing to spend a couple more dollars for their time. Time is money, and at the end of the day, if they can eliminate, say, four, five, six hours or more of 
all of that prep and planning to have it delivered and they can spend that time with their family or hobbies or nutrition uh, otherwise perhaps anything that they choose to do that is worth something to them and so time is money and there is a value and an observance of that convenience uh, perhaps one of the biggest uh, aspects for us and uh, why we are confident is because we think that people will absolutely and so far they have really appreciated the community aspect of our company we are giving back to the community we are using the community it is local uh, it is a cooperative organization and it's working and it feels good the main competition is no doubt online um, there are a handful of online giants do they offer what we offer not even close they do a good job at what they do but um, we differentiate ourselves by the main driver is our local focus we support locally we provide uh, a meal service to homes in El Paso, in El Paso communities uh, it's a constant outreach locally uh, as well as another angle that we see is not often available through our competitors is we offer recycling when customers are establishing their online profile they can opt into our recycling program which means once they are done with their meal kit they throw all of the packaging in the box that it came in put it on their porch and we come and pick it up we reuse what we can and what we can't we recycle at the end of the day we know that this will be a fantastic venture for you to buy into. We are a group of people that really love this company. We love what we do. We have a lot of fun. We have a relatively simple profile that has remained quite profitable. And it really is a great service to be giving back to our community while creating and growing a business. We really appreciate your consideration and we look forward to your investment and partnering together. Thank you.